Think globally, farm locally. Welcome to Backyard Farming. So first po, tatalakayin natin ka backyard is the materials and the capital. So magkano ba, how much it will cost to start hydroponics at home. Uh, my setup is very simple. Uh, this greenhouse just costs 1,500 pesos. So, except the labor because I only did this one uh, just to start on a hydroponics and learn, practice, and having error. So, it's been more than one year that I'm doing hydroponics Kratki method and having extra income for, for our family. So, first is the greenhouse, 1,500 pesos. You can start at that price. Number two is the styro box, this one. This styro box. How much would it cost here? I bought this at uh, 1,000 pesos. Not all of this. There are many more that I will use. But my space is so limited, so I'll explain more later. So each box, I bought it at 50 pesos to my friend this is a grape box so you just made a hole on it and use it sometimes uh, what I did is I put some cellophane so that it will not the water will not go out number three is water for the every 500 heads so I place here 100 pesos for the water and number four is the nutrient solutions how much is the nutrient solution? So I will show you. This is the nutrient solution that I bought from Shopee. I use Nutri Hydro because I already use it. I already tested it. So the cost of this nutrient solution is 550 per liter. So ang pair na ito is 550. 1 liter, 1 liter. So, 550 itong dalawa. And the other one is you need you need the pH up and pH down. I will show you that one. pH up and pH down. So, this is the partner here. So that you can test your pH rightly. You know, the pH of your water. So, if it goes higher, you use the pH down, it goes lower, you use the pH up. So the, the, the meter that we're going to use for that is the pH meter and the TDS. But the price of this one, the pH up and pH down, is 400 pesos. So it's 400 pesos, this pair is 400 pesos. And the other one is I also bought the iron. This iron, you need this one so that the taste of your lettuce will be more crispier and, and more delicious compared to having, not applying this iron. This cost 485 pesos. You can try by um, not having iron and with iron you will really see the taste or you will taste it differently I like more about this especially with our customer so the other one is the meters I will show you the meters that I've used so this is the two meters you need to start hydroponics the other the one is the pH meter the pH meter used to test the pH level of your water. The proper uh, pH exact or for me that really works for lettuce is at least in 6, 6.0, you know, because that is the meter or level that the lettuce will absorb nutrients, 6.0. And this one is the TDS. The TDS is used to get your PPM or parts per million. 
the total dissolved solid you know it will test here at least you will test this one uh, in the water with nutrients to 700 to 800 ppm so that your lettuce will really grow big with together with the right level of pH and I will make that detail more in the description below I will put there some um, practical steps how to use this one and how to properly use the meters for the hydroponics so it's here in my channel and especially in description below if you want to learn how to use this one properly uh, how to get the level the pH and the TDS another one is the seeds seeds that will cost at least 500 seeds you know for this video just est estimate 500 seeds because every these two nutrient solutions is equal to 500 heads of lettuce two nutrient solutions is equals to 500 heads and i will show you later how much is the income of this one liter with 500 heads or seeds so that seeds at, at least will cost to 500 also no? 500 or more uh, pesos including the uh, what do you call that the shipment and number seven is the styro cups so you need the styro cups or others use other medium but I use styro cups so the styro cups I will show you how to uh, make holes on it in a description below also I will show you how to do that uh, step by step without using electricity okay so this one cost at least 150 you know for your start for the start 150 pesos and the cuckoo pit will cost here is 200 per sack so that 200 per sack it will really uh, that is enough for 500 heads and even more than enough so that will cost more or less 5,000 all in all for the capital and the materials so if you want to start hydroponics at home at least you have 5,000 make it six or seven for the extra um, including the shipping and the things that you need to buy so and even the labor part of it so at least 5,000 to 6,000 you can start your hydroponics at home but the question is is there any income by using hydroponics is there any income that will come back to you as soon as possible and I will tell you later there is there is income here three category is all about income just what I have said is there any income of hydroponics like this set up here in our home in our backyard so this is my backyard hydroponics so for one liter of solution is equals to 500 heads so you need to to put that your mathematics okay one liter of solution is equals to 500 heads so uh, the, the price of each the price of each lettuce here in our place cost 35 pesos each 35 pesos each so this one is uh, I think it's 40 days 30 maybe 35 to 40 days this is different levels there are schedules here because we want to produce every week so in my setup I I planned we planned to have an harvest every week 20 heads every week at least 20 heads every week so that 20 heads every week that is the minimum that's a minimum times 35 each is equals to 700 so monthly if we can do that minimum of 20 we can earn 200 2800 pesos monthly if we can produce 20 heads per week wow that's amazing 28 20 heads per week and if monthly we can earn 2800 pesos because 700 
20 times 35 is 700 pesos. 700 times 4 weeks is 2,800 pesos. And that is big uh, income for this setup. So, because in every 500 heads, if we can sell 500 heads and 35 pesos each, it will cost to 17,000. So that is the possible income of having uh, 5,000 capital, a minimum of capital of 5,000 to 6,000. You can have a possibility to earn 17,000 pesos. 17,000 pesos. So you can have a possible income of 12,000 from your 5,000 capital. I hope this lesson or this topic uh, help you and I would encourage you to try small. I started before like four boxes, four boxes. So just learn and try, trial and error. And now I, I have two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve boxes. And then planning to expand this month and planning to, to do something uh, to expand in my, in my parents' house because there is a demand of lettuce. So we have customer already. So per week we can, we can deliver and we can produce. My goal is at least I can produce 40, 40 heads per week or even 50 for this time. That's it, Kabakyard. God bless you. See you next time.